For the design dimension, it's important that you are enthusiastic and critical at the same time on fashion as a cultural phenomenon and as an industry. My name is Oscar Reimakers. I'm a design teacher at the Fashion and Design Dimension of Amfi. Uh, I work as a design teacher here since 2012. You also have to be curious about how you can make a positive contribution to an innovative, sustainable and inclusive future of fashion. The relationship with the body always plays a central role. You will learn how to explore your personal fascinations and interests through research and experiment. You will implement your research results into fashionable products that are both qualitative and sustainable. You will learn to profile your vision and your products in the most relevant way. Alumni students of our dimension started their own independent label or design studio, working for high-end fashion houses or commercial brands. But in recent years, new profiles are emerging, such as the digital designer, the deadstock designer, the technical designer, or social designer. Developing both analog and digital skills and understanding their relationship is an important component of our training. It offers you many new opportunities within the professional field. There is a growing demand for designers who master both the digital and the analog skills. The program of the second year is the same for every designer and has two semesters. In the first semester, called Atelier, you work on developing your own handwriting through experimentation and mastering the necessary techniques and skills to develop and realize your design vision. In the second semester, called Studio, you will learn how to use this personal handwriting within the context of an existing brand, both individually and as a team. Studio also gives you insight into how design processes take place in a company. From the third year on, there is the flexible program. Here you can choose from a range of different minors and specializations. In consultation with your mentor, you will plan the route that fits best to your future plans. As a design student, you also do a mandatory internship. The graduation projects of the design dimension have become increasingly diverse and multidisciplinary in recent years. My name is Hendrik, I'm from Maastricht and I'm studying second year design at Amfi. This year we are working on several things. We learn the basics of design from the start, which includes draping, couture, patterns, fashion drawing and construction. Besides that, we are working on our own collection. Part of the collection is worked out in the drawings and part of it is a physical collection. We get a lot of possibilities to immerse ourselves in the digital world. So I took that opportunity to dive into that. It changes my own perspective on the fashion industry and the direction it's taking. I've been able to come up with an amazing plan to use digitalization to leave part of the design chain out of the process. I've noticed that the people around me really inspired me to grow, both as a person and as a designer. I thank my classmates for that.
Ever since I was young, I have a certain perspective on learning things from peers and from teachers. I feel like it's easier for me to get feedback from someone closer to me, and sometimes I tell myself that's not the case with the teachers. But I came to the realization that it's an illusion of my own mind. I realized more and more that school is a place to develop myself and not just an obligation. can in fact make anything your mind comes up with. The second year is super free. At this moment I'm working on a manga in which my superheroes create a new world and the fashion derives from that story. I really enjoy doing that. This gives me a great freedom within design. The drip is inside, you only have to create it. Design really works for me and I'm grateful for all my teachers for this realization. My name is Cornel Doornebos. I'm an international fashion design graduate from 2020. An acquaintance of mine told me about Amphi and recommended me to go check out the open day, which I did and I was immediately intrigued by the work displayed there. Also, I've always been quite a hands-on person, preferring to work 3D instead of 2D. And when I first started, I was really interested in textiles and the way they influence different pattern cutting techniques. So therefore, I chose design. Even though it's so early on in the process, try to think about what you would want to get out of this study path. And if your main future interests or goal aligns with this, what things are essential for you to learn in order to get to where you think you want to be? And when you do choose to go for the design path, be prepared to be pushed by yourself really hard and enjoy the struggle of trying to find your specific way of working and your handwriting. How important it is to show devotion and deliver high quality products. Also, your personal vision is a backbone to the product or concept you're creating and therefore essential. Not every designer needs to graduate with a physical collection. And next to the traditional fashion show, alternative presentations are also included. The fashion designer of the future is flexible and open and can anticipate a society and industry that is ever-changing and transforming.